So this is Daisy, the day that I can't fucking do this. <laughs> right, so this is Daisy the Daily. The new pink card. Um, I paid 750 quid for this little moment, so believe it or not. Now, the only reason I bought it, it has, it has had like, literally well over a grand spent on it. So, like, it's done 180,000 miles. So, good old girl. <laughs> nah, she's, she's alright. She's, um, she's done about 500 miles away since I owned it, and it hasn't missed a beat. The only thing I had to do is put, because there was a hell of a clunking noise on it on the back, I was like, it was really bad. Um, but it was just two rear top mounts, and then the wheel bearing was fucked on the offside rear, so I changed that one around as well. But apart from that, She's beautiful. Obviously, being 750 quid, there's going to be a few problems, so let me show you. Ross number one. Bobby paint. Just a little ding. Just a little dent. A few paintwork marks. And then this little beauty, which is, yeah, silicone. So, yeah. This is my Mark IV Golf 1.9 TDI. Now, I had a nightmare because me and Chris from Global went to go pick this up. And got there and the bloke said it was a PD-130 engine. So I was like, oh, I do. Beautiful. Got there, brought it back. And um, yeah, it's not a PD-130, it's a PD-115. So she's lacking in power. And nah, it's, it's all right, it's all right. It is a bag of shit, but I do actually think it's it'll get me around. And it's banging on fuel, not gonna lie, lads, as well. So yeah, if I flip the camera around, I will just show you around inside a little bit. It is shit high because I went taxiing last night and I like my McDonald's, so I've had a lot of McDonald's as well. So, the good features, we've got like climate control, which is sick. I'll let me put my keys on quickly, I'll start that up, wherever my keys are. Oh, and we've got, a, we've got a little bit like that, when I start it up, right. We've got an airbag bolt, so that's not good. So there's the climate control, I'll wait for that to sort itself out. And we've got an electric sunroof, oh, you've got to see the electric sunroof, right. Look at this. So, because we got a problem here. So basically, I think this is how it works. You like spin this one do it that way. So that lifts it up. Back down it goes. And then you twist it like all the way around and it goes up and then back. Whoa, look at that. Fucking absolute minter. Look at the sunroof. Jesus Christ, look at the state of this. But then yeah, you can go back in the car. And actually, I think if we put it like that, hopefully it should go back all the way and go down properly. I don't even know if it's come down properly actually. Yeah, uh, sometimes it like misses a bit. It like goes over that side. It's a bit weird. I need to get this resealed really. So apart from that, airbag light to sort out, which is just a sensor underneath the seat. That's easy, six speed. There's your climate control. Got the, got, actually got a six CD player. Let me move this. I'm just gonna move this thing out of the way. Got a CD player as well, which is apparently quite rare to have in these. So it's got quite a few odd op optional extras. A few more Mackey's bags, just to add to the McDonald's bags. Bring that one back up. Look at the cup holders. Whoa. Minza, but yeah, 179,000, uh, 642. But yeah, I've done that amount of miles, 148, on literally like 10 pounds worth of fuel which is like unbelievable. I think that's pretty good. So, and the insurance, to be fair, it's not even that bad as well. So yeah, it's not too bad. The seats are nice, got a nice little armrest. Um, this is just falling apart. I think I could take this off. Yeah, it's just, nah, just falling apart. Bear bottle down there, because I was taxiing last night. And then in the back, the back seats are like really cozy as well. I think this bit actually does come down. Yeah, so you got like a little armrest as well there. It's a good little car, really. Oh, one other little thing is that I had a slight little leak last night. I don't know. I don't really know what's going on. I think it's come from the sunroof up here, but it's had a little leak. Like, nice. It's just literally just dripped on me. What the fuck? What the fuck? Ugh. This is yeah. So we've got a leak. We have to sort out. But yeah, no worries about that, eh? Now, yeah, that's that's the car. Don't worry, lads. This is not not the car i'm gonna just keep now this is not this is just daisy the daily i can't believe i'm naming a car i've never named the car in my life but i'm actually naming the car for once but 
work has had done is literally like a new dual mass, new clutch, um, it's had a new turbo, and that's mainly the reason why I bought it, even though it's high mileage, but I know these PD engines go on for ages, so that's one of the reasons why I bought them. And I've had one of these before, if you've checked out my video where on how many cars I've owned, um, that is like, I've have had one of these before, so I might just put, it's got on coilovers as well, it is on coilovers, I forgot to mention, so I might just literally put a set of wheels on it. And just slam the coilovers down, what your dad's reckon. But yeah, we'll have a little, we'll have a little full walk around it quickly, and then um, I can let you decide if you like it or not. But it's um, it's it's alright, boys, and it it's it'll get me around. I can go see Lockwood now. I can go see Tommy. I can go see Frosty Fez. I can just go see all the lads now, and then um, yeah, and then I can just obviously. Don't worry, this was just only one of my cars. I'm gonna get another car, which will be a project car with sick car. This is just days of the day to get it around in. But if you have a Mark IV Golf and you'd like to see me do stuff to it, I was going to record me doing the rear top mounts and um, and then everything else that I've had done. But yeah, and it's got, even got like a little button down here. I don't know if you can see. There you go. That one there is for the fuel cap. It opens up the fuel cap. To be fair, it's an 18 year old car, right? And it's got all this tech. Like, I'm not gonna lie, I think that's pretty cool. But yeah. We'll walk around the car quickly with it running it ticks over sweet like i'm not even joking for 179 valves and you even believe it i think i'm going to give it a service a whack and oil filter um whack some whack an oil filter and oil some oil and fuel filter as well maybe check out the glow plugs injectors see what's going on see if they're all working well i mean it's ticking over fine so there's no problems but yeah i just want to make sure everything's sweet because to be honest um oh one cool thing i've got to show you is the service history of this right this I am literally, I'm the third owner of this car, right? And look at the service history I've got. All of this. It's even got the receipt in there, right? From when the car was first bought in the year 2000. Like it's still in the original Volkswagen thing. It's got the Volkswagen, uh, where is it? Like cards and that there as well. All original and it's got all the paperwork for everything that's been done to it. It is sick. Like the price I paid, 750 quid. And I've sorted out the knocking, because the knocking noise was horrendous, but yeah. It's, I think it's alright. What do you guys reckon? Comment down below and let me know. But yeah, I'll show you around the full car around the outside um, and let me know what you think I should do to it. I've, that dent is hellish over there, I know. But I don't have to do with that. But yeah, I'll get out and show you. That. Right, so yeah, ticks over lovely. Honestly, it's so nice. One thing I do like is the headlights in these, actually. They're very nice. But yeah, as you can see, it's X Reg. Um, I don't know if you can hear me. I'll turn the car off, actually. Or oh, actually, when you turn, I think I need a new engine mount as well. Because listen, when you turn it off, oh, lads, listen, have a listen to this. Oh, oh, that is horrible. But um, yeah, so this is a dent that has to get sorted out. In fact, it's just on the rear panel, like, I don't know if it's something you can get knocked out, because it's just a metal pa panel underneath here, I think. But yeah, it's on coilovers, the discs are a bit warped, I'm gonna have to get the discs sorted out, but yeah, you can see the coilovers in that back there. Might wind them down a little bit. I've already put new rear AD bulbs in it. I'm gonna do a video on D wiper in it, because that'd be cool. I'm probably gonna do a video on taking the badges off as well might spray these black might do a few little bits to it this arch is fine it did have uh it's got a few little marks down here but no over that boys it did have um did that come off yeah it comes off it did have mud flaps on the front and the back i took the back ones off now i'm gonna take the front ones off and we're running arrow speed budget tires boys but they are brand new came with four brand new tires on that as well and we're missing a missing a sun and cap so yeah there's a fair few things we got to do to this car lads but Overall, she is a little beauty. Look at it. Love it. But yeah, I'm going to wrap that video up here, boys and girls. So if you have enjoyed it, make sure you give it a thumbs up. It is Daisy the Daily. The little sexy thing. But um, if you think Daisy's a good name, let me know in the comments down below. I think Daisy's a good name. Matches. Daisy the Daily. Sick. But um, yeah, I'm going to wrap this video up here, guys. If you like this car, make sure you give it a thumbs up. It's actually, you know, the engines in them are really, really good. They do last for ages. So I think I might stick around with it just as a daily. I was, that isn't the car. I did say to you guys, I knew what car I was going to get. That isn't the car I was going to get. I was going to get a Fiesta Z to Guess TDCI. This came up really cheap. I thought I'm going to have to go do it. And, um, and yeah, I went and bought it. So that is Daisy the Daily. So yeah, if you've enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you're new as well. And hit the bell button to be notified every single time I upload. Um, videos are going to be coming out now a lot more. And obviously the project, the actual real project may come um, around Christmas time, beginning of the new year. But it will be here, lads. And don't worry for now, I will be bringing out videos in the Gulf. I mean, should I get it mapped? 
180k, should I get them out? I mean, who would like to see this thing? I'm not really bothered by it, like it's 750 quid, so I might just do some crazy shit with it. But just comment down below what you'd like to see in the next video, and I'll try and get onto it for you guys. So yeah, thanks for watching as always, guys. All my social media links are in the description down below. Check it out, I love you all. Thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now. Oh my God, oh my God, if I die, I'm a legend. When they lay me down to rest, I know I was always prepping. Oh my God, my whole life, my words been my greatest weapon. I know.